What's going on, my guys? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Gary with Game of the Beach. Very excited to be here with you today because we're going to be playing around with my level 7 robot. You heard that right. No talents, level 7 robot. And let me just say real quick that it is kicking and taking names. You will not believe how well a level 7 robot performs, especially with this week's faction booster, where it's just getting a little boost from the attack speed and damage when killing a boss and mini boss, as well as getting cleansed a little bit. But I haven't played robot in who knows how long, and it's back. And we're in there, and it's, it's super, super fun. So guys, grab your coffee, grab your device, and let's head on down to Game by the Beach. Welcome back once again, fellas. We're gonna be jumping right into a game today, playing a card and a deck that I bet you guys haven't seen me play in a long, long time. We're gonna be rocking with our level seven robot. You heard it here, level seven. No talents, of course, no nothing. Level seven all the way, it should be fun. But let's give it a go. Okay, we're gonna be rocking with our Summoner talents left side, okay, and uh, and seeing what we can do on the ladder. We're going up against the level eleven, level eleven. Um, let's just merge out all these pretzels. Demon hunter, decent, decent. It's no level seven uh, robot though. Come on now. I'm just gonna merge that right there. At least wake him up a little bit. We're gonna go right there. We're gonna go right here. And I guess let's just focus on like a couple of these. I'm gonna level him up. So like the ones on buff tiles, I'm probably just gonna kind of leave to be around. But everything else I'm gonna merge out. So like these guys are going away. These guys are going away. I'm gonna merge these. I'll merge that that way. We can do that way as well, that way as well. Can merge out all these guys. And look how quickly we can just spam things out. So we're only at three tiers for our robots. Um, but our board is pretty far along, to say the least. Okay, let's go. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Can I do, like, anything else that would look good? I guess I can go here, here, here. Level up our robot one time. It's a constant struggle of do I focus on summoners or do I just copy robots and spam them out? I feel like that's the boring way to do it. But you got to get to 20 tiers. And I'll tell you right now, I have no idea if this deck is going to work, okay? Oh, let's do this. I don't want to I don't want to get moved. I have no idea. We're going up against level 13J. We've got a leg up. We've got a level 14J. So clearly we're going to win. Level 11 bow, level 10 that. Our equipment is pretty similar at least. Um in most terms, uh, let's see. What do I want to do? I guess I'll just do that and that. I'm gonna go, let's do, um, I'm gonna do this and this weird play, absolutely. Am I gonna do it anyway? Absolutely, we're gonna go right there, we're just gonna hit that right there. I'm gonna merge these guys out too. Robot, I'll take it. If I was playing the way I would like to play, I would constantly have a rank one robot that I can continuously spam out. But that hasn't been the case so far. And I should probably utilize our summoner spam also. Like right there. Let's change that to a robot. Boom. Just like that, fellas. Just like that. Okay. I'm going to go here. I'm going to go here and here and here. And we can just get this guy all the way up to a five. Why the heck not? We'll merge that right there. We're at seven. Our goal is to get to ten stacks before this next puppeteer that's what i want to do i'm not going to use my j until we see puppeteer because it's still very important to me that we don't get moved and we've already had a ton of rank four units to where hopefully eventually hopefully eventually we can get rid of that rank four summoner anybody else i'm just going to merge this that'll get us to nine anybody else is there anybody else I'm spam tapping before puppeteer. Can I uh, can I change that? Oh, oh, I forgot to hit my J. Oh, it didn't matter. 
As you can tell, I'm playing this phenomenally, but I'm also using this because it is part of the faction booster this week, right? Technogenic Society removes negative debuffs, which is kind of like utilizing or kind of like having a talent that you don't always... Let me reword this. It's kind of like playing with a talent that you don't have. If I had Monk at a high level or Tesla at a high level, I think with Robot, I don't know if Robot has, has a cleanse ability or not. I've only ever played with a level seven. Um, but if we did have a high level, then you would have a cleanse ability, which is what this week's faction booster is giving you. So that's a bit of fun. Okay, we're now at 10 tiers. We should probably be working to get a little bit higher than that. We'll go here and here and here. The only thing is we've got some nice high level robots. We just need to get those merges all the way up also. And then we can focus a little bit more on our, I'm gonna go there. I don't even know, what is this gonna change? Oh, that's interesting. That stinks. Okay. I'll do this because maybe we get a summoner. Boom. Oh, I can change those too. Let me wait. Because I can change those into robots, hopefully, by hitting the, that summoner. But yeah, level 7 plus the faction booster somewhat equals a uh, different level. It actually shows you on the map which ones will get changed. There we go. Extra robot, I'll take that. Extra summoner, why the heck not? I'm gonna go here. Perfect. Uh, perfect, rank four, yes sir. Absolutely. Absolutely, 15. Not terrible. We've got a couple of rank twos that we can use. We have a rank two over here that maybe we can switch one on around. We've got uh, King Pudding next. So let us fill our board and then pray to the Rush Royale gods that King Pudding doesn't hit some really high ranking units that we want to keep. Okay, because we've got three rank fives, three rank fours, and a rank three. So let's just, you know, be nice. It was actually pretty nice. It was genuinely pretty nice. Okay, okay. We're just going to go here. I'll merge those out. Um, we've got rank threes that we can utilize. I'm actually going to do this. Weird play. Maybe. I'm going to do this and this. Not terrible. I'm going to go here. Here. Really good timing there. And we can do that and that'll get us to 20 we're now at tribunal in 30 seconds we will be able to hit our j once again i believe we can spam this out just to see what we find another rank three i'm kind of hesitant to spam out these dryads just in the case that we rank one of these units up to five and then it gets hit by tribunal that's a massive hit you know how many dryads it takes to go from four to five so I'd rather them be a little bit lower level. And then, ooh, we're gonna have to go through that. We actually are going through things pretty quickly. I'm, I'm, I'm honestly pretty happy with how um, robots performing. Okay, so we did take a hit. We did take a hit. We're gonna have to go there. We're gonna go here. I'm gonna do, I'm honestly gonna go here first. We still have, we only have one rank five now. That's kind of wild. We're gonna go over there. We're gonna go over here. We can get one of them back up to five and we can totally keep utilizing our pretzels. And I'm hoping pretzel is kind of what's going to be our saving grace here because we can go here. I'm going to hit my J 24 seconds cleanse. We're going to need that cleanse ability um, against dark priest and probably against warlock. I can do, I'm going to do this and this. Um, can I change one of those? kind of cool i just gotta fill my board back up okay five mil dark priest i think i'll hold off i'm gonna hit hit my j with um warlock Ooh, 
So we did get this guy debuffed and that guy, but it's only one robot out of the mix. That's not terrible. Another robot right there is fine. Are we even remotely close to having a chance at this? I don't know. You tell me. Let's change those. 20 seconds. We're running out of uh, out of merges here. So we've got Grandmaster as well as King Pudding. Um, at least with the merges, I don't know. We're, we're going to have to try our best. If he gets merged on by Grandmaster, which he realistically should, he's having trouble with that guy. Yeah. 11 mil versus 16. He's going to get merged on, certainly. That's way more detrimental to him than it is to me. Couple of rank fours. Fine by me, buddy. Fine by me, buddy boy. Grandmaster, merge another one of his. Not me. Uh, oh. Whoo. We got a cleanse right there. Did we also get a cleanse of... I need some more, uh, yeah, of those guys. Trappers. Trappers are important. Can I do anything else? I might actually merge out rank threes just to get more trappers on my board. Because I think it's more important. Yeah, perfect. I got a rank one I can't utilize. We're slowing things down. I don't want to get too ahead of myself, fellas. But it looks like he's going to take a hit. I, he might not lose here, though. 15 seconds is a long time. I'm going to have to get back to my J. He hit his J, but too little, too late. Hit him with a good game. Stop it, fellas. Stop it. You're too flattering. Okay. 3,000 crit. Level 13 J. Good equipment. Okay. I'll show my equipment also. His equipment is actually better than mine, other than this guy. Maybe. I feel like that's a pretty mediocre... Uh, equipment, but it says max legendary, so you got to give it to me, I guess. 3,000 equi equi uh, equipment. 3,000 equipment. 3,000 crit versus 3,000 crit. Level 11, Demon Hunter, second talent, plus against level 7 robot, and we came out on top. 400 million damage. Half of which was from RJ. <laughs> but... 400 million damage with a level 7 robot deck. Stop it. That's only one game in the books. Let's jump into game number two. I've got high expectations now. So let's go right into that game and see how we do. Second game underway. And once again, we're going up against a level 11 uh, legendary. Last time it was Demon Hunter. Now we're going up against Cultist. And this should be a fun one. Okay, so we're just going to go right here. We can start merging those out pretty soon. I guess we'll just get a second. Let's get a second um, robot first. We can do a little bit of that. I'm just going to merge these guys out. Um, we can do that. We're going to right there. We've already got a pretty good little start here. And I just want to make sure... So this guy isn't a debuff, right? He's not debuffed at all. I'm just going to level him up a little bit. And we're actually not dealing with sword this game he's got scrapper and portal keeper which when i'm playing cultist i usually have either scrapper or portal keeper he's got both in there um but that's because i like to play with sword maybe he doesn't even have it you never really know let's take a peek at his equipment level 9 level 5 legendary level 13 amulet so pretty much all of his equipment is better than mine and he's also rocking a trickster but this should be fun okay I, like i said in the last game fellas I've got such high expectations now that uh, a, a loss is uh, is out of the question. Unacceptable if we lose, all right? But fellas, if you are enjoying this video, make sure that you are subscribed to the channel, like the video, and if you want to help support the channel, make sure that you guys are going through my games and using code BEACH for all of your in-game purchases, okay? Rather than going through the app, Go to the store that's in my games. It's the exact same store. And if you're buying the Premium Pass, Hero Tavern Pass, Platinum, whatever it might be, use Code Beach and it helps support my channel and enables me to continue making the content that you guys enjoy so much without costing you guys 
anything. Okay. So I'm just gonna go. This guy is on a on a buff tile, so I might as well. I'm just gonna do that. Hit RJ just to take out Tribunal. That's such a blessing. Like the fact that we have the ability to take out Tribunal every time. I'm actually gonna spam out. Perfect. Um, it's just so so good. I'm gonna go over there. I feel like the J tiles are probably better than the boosted tiles, than the, uh, whatever the other ones are called. I'm gonna level that guy up. He's actually on a double buff tile right there, so we're definitely gonna utilize that. I like that we have the opportunity to switch summoners, getting extra, um, extra robots out there. And once you get to 20 tiers, you can just focusing on level up, F focus on leveling up. That means getting your rank fours that are on squares, getting them to rank fours, getting them to rank fives, and, uh, and just, Pushing the amount of pretzels that you have and that's pretty much the end game. I mean if we can make it to like 500 million damage This that's as as legit a deck as I play and we're rocking with the level 7 which is just mind-boggling 45 seconds. I need to find some more uh, some more s uh, Robots or summoners. I suppose Pretzel is not what I'm talking about <sighs> I'm gonna ro level up my robot one time. I'm gonna merge that guy too. 29 seconds. This is actually kind of scary to me. I need a robot merge in order to get to the uh, five stacks. That makes a big difference. Look at the difference in damage output already. Um, and now we have nothing to worry about for Bedlam. He's also using the... Um, okay, so we're gonna have to do that. Notice that every time I have a summoner with an orb, I always leave an extra space because we're using that left side talent. So now all three of those spaces are, are full. We're going to go here. We're going to go here. We're going to get that guy to five. Absolutely. Jay, beautiful. Only one cleanse. This guy is what would change. Cool. I'll take that. Merge those. Why the heck not? I'm actually liking this board a lot. And we can get one of these to rank five pretty easily. And this is a buff tile too. That guy is a massive buff tile. So we're going to go there. We're going to go there. Double buff on that guy. So now we've got no rank ones is the only, not problem. Now we have a rank one. So no problem whatsoever. We haven't had to deal with any, oh, I was going to say this earlier. We haven't had to deal with his abyss, his harbinger of the abyss. So that's good. And notice that if you keep an eye on my board, you'll see units that are the ones that would be changed if I used my summoner talent. I like that that's, a, that's the case. I have a hard time seeing that all the time, so I think that's really, really cool. Let's get one more summoner or... Nope, that's not what I wanted. I'm going to merge out rank twos. We're going to get that guy up. 20 seconds until Warlock. I think we'll be fine with our board until Warlock. And then we can... Hit RJ once we see the boss, just so we don't get hit by unnecessary bosses. Getting hit by a Warlock, if it hit my rank 4 or rank 5 or something, would be terrible. It, it, would, it would literally change the, the course of this game altogether. So I'm just going to hit it right here. He's got 5-5-5 five, five, five on his thing. So he does one summon. Here they come. Here's another one. I'm just going to let all of that... Oh, we can merge that up. Yeah, okay. So at least we did a little something something. I'm just going to do this. I'm still trying to get one more robot on my board so we can continue to merge away. Took too long, so I'm going to do that. Now I can do that. That's at 10. That's worthwhile. We're going to go here. And let's get back to filling our board because he's using Abyss. We want to just make sure... I'm going to hit my... Warp, my uh, J and my robot level up right there and we should be able to get back to our uh J before warlock shows up i think 30 seconds is long enough time to to prep he's got three 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 we've got some robots we can merge but i'm gonna hold off for right now just in case he spams some stuff and uh, and i want to make some changes so here we go three seconds warlock should be fine J is just about ready and we're gonna have to make some merges here we go Perfect. Perfect, perfect. We'll do that. We're going to go... I'm going to actually merge those. I'm going to do this and this for now. We're only at 12. We need to get to 20 
pretty soon. Banner Lords are always tricky. Merge those out. Rank three, boom. Summoners, we're definitely going here. We're gonna go here, merge those. 24 seconds, I'm gonna do... All right, let's wait for the Abysses because they're here they come. Um, I don't really have anything I wanna do, so it's fine. I'm just gonna kinda let it happen. We can do, yeah, let's wait for Dark Priest. We're gonna wait for Dark Priest just because I, if if uh, Dark Priest, Priest hits some of my rank 1s, I'll be able to merge them out pretty easily. I should actually probably have hit my J at the end of this wave rather than the beginning of the next wave because I don't care about how long it takes to take it out. So it hit my rank 4. It hit none of my rank 1s, um, which is super unfortunate. I'm just going to do that. I'm going to hit my rank 4 right there. Uh, I'm just going to do this. Merge that, merge that. We can go here, we'll do this. Um, we're just gonna do that. Anything else? Eh, it's fine. Hit my J as soon as I can. It might be a little bit late. Hmm. Oh, we can go here. He's having a tough time. We're also having a tough time, but... Clearly a less tough, tough time than him. And there is a victory. Hit him with a good game. Honestly, there's not a whole lot you can say. There really isn't. Okay, level 9 cultist, to say the least. Equipment still pretty equal. Level 9 and level 5. Level 13 epic. I've got level 4 and level 10. So those are kind of swapped for me and him. Level 1 epic. And then this guy, which if you've never seen this, just read it. It's really not that impressive. And uh, 2,800 crit, crit 2,750, 31. I got him by a little bit, but it's a level 11 legendary versus a level 7 legendary. Have you ever seen this? When's the last time you saw a level 7 robot performing on the ladder and doing work? We only did 150 million damage there, and we ended up doing almost 100 of that million, 100 of that 150 from our J. So definitely something to be said there, but either way, Robot level 7, performing in the meta. You absolutely love to see it. Fellas, that's going to be the end of this YouTube video. If you enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll check you guys out in tomorrow's video.